Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Insurgents. In the last episode, we took on the remaining two Elite Four members, Yuki and London. It wasn't very easy with this new team of mine, but we got through it in the end, although we're pretty low on, like, revives. Well, we have no revives, we have a couple of revival herbs, but we have plenty of, like, full restores or anything, so we should be okay. Um, I'm going to lead off with Lucario and Volcarona. Because if I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure it's a double battle. So let's get into this. I, I, I do, I do, I do got to say, I do like this, like, champion room. Like, the color scheme. This is quite good. Anyway. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, hi. I guess you're wondering who we are. I'm Graham. I'm Tobias. We're brothers. Twins, despite the size difference. There was some weird time stuff going on in Verison. We were in the Pokemon League members from there. I'm a gym leader, he was an Elite Four member. We were invited over after your previous champion left, and you know what that means? If you want to beat the league again, you're gonna have to take it on take on both of us at once. So do you think you can handle it? I'm a master of dark type Pokemon, and my brother excels in ghost types. Together we're completely undefeatable. Let's not waste any time. Oh, Isn't this like the original Elite Four theme? Although we should be okay against this. Um, Dark Pulse probably would be more effective against the Gengar. Question is the Spirit. It does the Spirit Tomb have a um, levitate? Well, I know Gengar would. So no. Let's, let's all get the game going for this. Wait, did it, why are they set at level 105? Oh, well, this would be easy then. Like, the Elite Four here are stronger than you. I say this now, but I'm probably going to struggle in a second answer. No, a crook, but I just one shot at both of the two Pokemon. Well, this is going to be quick. What's next then? Greninja. And Aegis Slash. Okay, so another Dark Post. And maybe another Horse. Actually, I'll use um, Dream Punch and Greninja. And then I'll use Dark Post on the Aegis Slash. Water type. Ah. <laughs> but you're already a water type. God damn it. And we didn't live. That's fine. Dark Pulse should do damage though. Wait, has it got a Focus Slash or something? Like, whack! I don't think. That'll be fine. Um, who do I go into at this time? I'm going to Gallade. I haven't really used Glade's Mega very often, so I might use it now. After all, I, I do like it. Okay, so let's go for a Thunder Punch and Greninja. And a Dark Pulse. Kinda sucks that Glade's being blocked off by a uh, Volker and a Sprite, but... What can you do? Oh wow, now it's even more blunt. <laughs> it's like you, you can barely see him. Came in ice time. You can live there, Volcrona. Got that tank of special defense. This would definitely be a bit more be, well be a bit more of a challenge if they was at the same level, but because they're not, it's just kinda ruins it. Oh my god, I paralyzed it with an elemental punch for once. Oh my god. Delta Milo Tech. Oh. It's a ghost type, so um Someone should definitely kill that Greninja, but I mean that Milo Tech. It looks like a problem, so I'm gonna deal with that first. Oh definitely it's a problem if it can mega evolve. 
What's this going to look like? Oh my god. Kind of looks like um, a slow vine or something. Superior, what, whatever Snivy's last like evolution is. Just like different colors. Although it's gone, we got a critical hit. Okay. I also paralyzed that one as well. Well. Okay. It became a poison type. You're finishing Grin or Corona off, or yeah. Oh, this will be able to see the late sprite now. Yo, um, go into Greninja. Which one is better? <laughs> Probably that one, to be honest. Um, we outspeed it. Go for a leaf blade. Yeah, do enough. So have I only got one more to deal with now? Shift three. Kinda sucks that they only had one Delta Pokemon actually. I can end this with a single ice punch. Wait, why didn't I get to choose for Greninja? Okay. It can make it evolve. It kind of looks evil. Although I don't think it's gonna live too long. Okay, live that. Yeah. Critical hit with an ice punch. That was a bit unnecessary, but okay. I definitely had a lot of harder time taking the, the Elite Four than I did them just now. Like, you should have just made an Elite Four member become a champion or something. I've defeated Champion Tobias and Champion Grey. Hmm, not bad. Uh, this, is, this is like a ghost sprite behind him. <laughs> okay, that one is definitely noticeable. Um, oh, you took me out. Ooh, 21,000. Wow. The trainers here in Torin are pretty impressive. Oh, hello, Professor. It seems as if... Wait, what the... You... Your kids. How is it that the strongest trainers in the region are all got... <sighs> hello, Professor. Congratulations, Adam. And uh, as usual, it seems like you're the champion. Just recently, you... Isn't this the same speech as before? Actually, no, she talked to Ruka a bit more than the last time. Just recently you were in my lab, choosing your very first Pokemon. And now you're the champion of the Touring League. Again? That amazes me. I'm so proud of you. Come. Let's get your re get you registered in the Hall of Fame. Well. I, I, I don't feel like I deserve it after that battle. Like, that battle was... That was... Can I rebattle them, but with higher levels? So it's a bit even. Much of this region, and now you've beaten its league again. You deserve it. Da -da -da -da. Lucario. Volker. Volker on a sprite is just huge. I don't know if it's because of the armor, because it didn't have all that background before. And Charizard. Well, okay, oh, that's me, didn't buy any of the clothes or anything, just standard. Money was a problem in this game a little bit, but then I did the racetracks and got like a really good sponsorship on the racetracks, so I had like a money multiplier of like 250 or something like that. So every race I won, I got like uh, 11 grand, so I only had to win a couple of races to have a bit of money. But yeah, that's the end of this episode. In the next episode, which will be coming towards the end of the series, we'll be going to Dev Island, so Developer Island, and we'll be taking on the developers, I believe. I don't know how many there was, or is on the Developer Island, so it could be one or two episodes long. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.